What's going on guys? So we've finally gotten images and a reveal for the Voltron Defenders of the Universe project that uh, was put on LEGO Ideas way back in 2016. So this set is going to be set number 21311 Voltron containing 2,321 pieces retailing for 180 US dollars coming out July 23rd for VIPs and August 1st for everybody else. This set is really really cool even coming from someone that doesn't watch Voltron or know anything about the show. Just looking at the pictures here, first of all, the box art looks really cool. It's got a really cool almost 80s-ish aesthetic to it. Uh, and like I said, I know nothing about Voltron, so please forgive my ignorance throughout this video. I'm probably going to say some things that are just completely wrong. Uh, and if I do, please let me know down in the comments. I'd love to hear from you guys and just know more about this set because it's cool. Um, so without further ado, let's just take a look at it. Uh, first of all, like I said, the box is really cool, and all the limbs are going to come off and become these, like, tiger cat things, which I think is really cool. This is as close to a Lego Transformer as I think we're ever going to get. Uh, the colors on it are just phenomenal, and the detail is just next level. And the fact that it's $180 for almost 2,400 pieces, that's a really solid deal. Uh, it doesn't look like there's any particularly, like rare I guess you could say pieces there's a lot of prints it looks like uh, those one two three four five uh, prints around it on each of the limbs look really good so let's take a look at each of the limbs now this first one is gonna be part of the torso it's gonna be this kind of black tiger uh, you can see the wings on the back over there uh, it's really cool and the fact that they were able to make all of these builds work uh, in a way that works with both Lego and represents the show and what this mech is able to do in the show is really cool uh, really nice detail on here and just looking at pictures from the show it looks like it's very very accurate uh, the next one is the blue one uh, kind of a little bit of a different design and that's what that's what's really cool I'm guessing in the show that each of these limbs kind of has their own like character or whatever uh, but each of these uh, builds is just slightly different and I really really like that see how this blue one here looks really good uh, not too too incredibly detailed but definitely uh, gets the point across with really nice prints there on the legs and limbs of this particular build. So the yellow one, kind of the same deal, but a little bit different. Uh, it's got those red fins at the back, and just like I said, just really detailed stuff. And it's got these Technic bars at the bottom that are really gonna, I'm guessing, hold it together and make this mech real solid. The green one here, once again, looks really solid. Uh, so this green one's got these really cool like curves over the limbs and like I just I, I love how each of these kind of has their own little character and own little bits to the build so it's not just monotonous I really like uh, just every little detail that they have thrown into these really nice the red one here uh, once again just a little bit different really solid so looking at the back of the box here you're gonna be getting this giant sword which looks really cool uh, and you can kind of see how everything's sticking together uh, and just love I need I need to ask you guys if anyone does watch Voltron out there I really want to know how accurate this set is did they really just na hit the nail on the head here and Absolutely do everything that you have ever imagined from a Lego Voltron set or did they miss a few things Please let me know I'd love to hear but the bottom of the box here you can see all five of the mechs separated and Then once again all sticking together up there at the top of the box like I said, I love this set. I know nothing about it, but I wanted to get the news out to you guys because I'm sure there's tons of people out there that love this show. Uh, like I said, fill me in on every little thing that I missed. I'm sure I've missed a lot, but I'm very excited to see the set on shelves, see the set get sold because it's, it's venturing into a territory that LEGO really hasn't before, and I really like seeing the company expand and we're getting new, unique sets. But other than that, if you haven't hit the subscribe button already, hit the subscribe button down below. I'll keep you filled in on LEGO leaks, reviews, and news, and all sorts of other cool LEGO videos as they come out. But other than that, guys, I'll see you in the next one.